Hey everybody, how's it going? It's Richard W here. What's going on? So this is W checking in. Unscripted, unedited. Uh, um, basically, this is W checking in. But uh, yes. So what's been going on with me? Now I know I haven't been streaming in a while. I know I haven't been posting videos in a while. And um, I, I, I gotta tell you, you know, that I've been obsessed over Horizon Zero Dawn. It's a very good game, and if you haven't picked it up yet, if you haven't played it yet, please do. It's an amazing game. Like, I love it. I love the shit out of it, and I kind of wish I streamed it. I really did. Um, I know I should be getting back to Resident Evil 8, but I don't know when I'm going to be getting back to that. Um... Lately, I got an Oculus, um, or a MetaQuest 2 as it's called now, but we all know it's an Oculus. Um, and it's a virtual system, which I do have an unboxing recorded of it. I just have to edit and post it. I got lots of footage I got to edit and post. Like, it's, it's ridiculous how much. <sighs> I just don't want to edit. <laughs> At least not right now. Um, but yeah, I've been playing Onward with my friends um, from work. I Onward is like this Call of Duty kind of clone. And one of my favorite games to play on is Gun Game. Um, it's this, and for those of you that are not familiar with what Gun Game is, you basically go through the guns of the game, you know, as you make a kill so you kill an opponent and then your gun changes to a different gun and it slowly and slowly gets more difficult until you end up with a knife you know that you have to knife the player in order to, to win you know very cool game love it very much um yeah i've been really digging my vr system like it's Like, I didn't think I could love a VR system more than that one. Like, um, I, I have PlayStation VR, but it pales in comparison to the, the MetaQuest. And I kind of wish there was a lot more games available on the MetaQuest, especially, like, the, uh, the VR games that I experience on PlayStation, which eh, nothing you can do there. But, yeah, um... Most of the time on my available time, on, on the time that I normally would be streaming, I'm playing with friends online. And that's what's taking up most of my time. And see, I could stream in the morning, but here's the problem is that I, I still have everybody kind of sleeping. So, and I don't really have the time because... I need to have the time to wake up, eat breakfast, shower, you know, get ready for work, essentially. And uh, I just haven't had time to do the uh, things for my channel, you know, like uh, like recording this video. Like, I, it's it's been like at least like three weeks since I was trying to record this video. And like, uh, I like to record these videos by myself. I don't like... To do it with people around because then you get commentary and then you know you kind of uh be like oh then i have to react to that and i, I want to keep these like you know me you know just me anyways anyways um had a wonderful ah fucking timer i gotta take the dog out in a minute here um, had a wonderful weekend. Um, one of the Saturdays I took off, uh, went to Mars Cheese Castle, which is somewhere in Wisconsin. I don't remember exactly where. Um, great place. It's got loads of things, uh, different kinds of sodas, beers, cheese, jams, jellies, crackers, uh, beef sticks, sausages. They even got venison over there, too, which is pretty good. Um, I ended up spending probably about $70 there, <clears throat> roughly. 
And I was not expecting to spend that much, you know, there. And <laughs> Here's the thing. I didn't even buy any alcohol. I know. Weird, right? And then uh, we went down to uh, Illinois to go uh, to Mitsuwa. Mitsuwa is this Japanese grocery store in which they have everything you could possibly think of uh, that you would have at, at a Japanese grocery store. Like, you know, you got all your cooking utensils there. You got a grocery and a fresh produce section. Fresh, you know, uh, meat, you know, like all this incredibly fresh stuff. Like, I bought myself a uh, wasabi root just because I never tried, like, actual wasabi because most American wasabi is actually just horseradish. Now you know. Um, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, had a loads of fun time there. And then uh, we... Somebody had to go to Ikea because they were closing and they needed to buy something. So I stuck around at uh, at my buddy's place for, for a little bit and we watched uh, a couple films. Um, one of them that I didn't know actually existed because I thought, you know, that was it. Now, if you guys ever watched uh, Stronger, Better, Faster, uh, the Daft Punk music video, there is actually... A movie called Interstellar 5555, which I didn't even know that existed. Like, it's basically one huge long music video, which I'm just like, there's more to the music video? Holy shit! But yeah, I had a great time on that Saturday. Like, oh man, um... He actually borrowed me a couple of videos, too. Like, uh, the Trigun video. Um, Buckaroo Banzai. Reanimator. And Moon. Moon was kind of weird and interesting, you know. And to see Sam Rockwell, uh, that young, too. Like, that was pretty good. And Reanimator um, was uh, interesting, to say the least. Um, I, I, I enjoyed it. Um, I think there's a second one, I, I believe. And then Trigon. I, I swear to God, this story looks familiar. Uh, this is Trigon Badlands Rumble. I swear to God, it looks familiar. And then... Uh, Lately, I've been taking a little bit of break from video games. Um, even, like, Kirby's Forgotten Lands, like, I, I've taken a break from. Um, in favor of watching Family Guy. Now, my family, uh, growing up, only watched Family Guy so much. And I never really got a chance to, like, actually, like, go through and watch it and stuff. But, like, um... Going through it and actually just going through it and watching it, like, they make, like, a lot of callbacks to throwaway jokes. Like, oh, my God. Like, I, I, I can't I can't reference any at the moment. But, like, I, I'm, I'm seeing all these, like, small references here. And, and like, oh, it has a callback to that one. And, oh, my God. Oh, that one. Oh, I remember that little bit, you know, like, just the little fine details, and it's, I, I like how it's written, like, it's written pretty darn well, but yeah, um, not gonna lie, kind of obsessed, um, so I'm already up to season seven, episode eight, Family Gay is what it's called. Yeah, uh, I was just in the middle of watching it. I'm like, you know, I should really record this, you know. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I don't know when I'm going to get back to streaming. Um, hopefully soon. Um, I got to work out in my head, you know, how I want to do it and when I want to do it. You know, when, I have to, like, make time to do it is what I need to do. 
It's not that I don't enjoy streaming. It's just I I I, I chase you know what's ca caught my attention at the time, which is a problem. I uh, probably should get medicine for that, but yeah, you know, it is what it is. But hope you guys enjoyed watching. I really do appreciate it. I really gotta get the dog uh, out potty, and then I gotta put him in his house, and I gotta get to work. But uh, Hope you guys enjoyed. This is Richard W. saying, have a good morning. Have a good afternoon. Have a good whatever. I'll catch you guys later. Take care now. Bye-bye. Bye-bye now.